you have probably have heard cloud, virtual, and open run terms from radio access network vendors. Everyone might be explaining them in their own way, and it can be confusing for many of you like me. In this short episode, I will try to explain these technologies related to drone architecture. If you don't know what is RRU, BBU, CU, and DU, don't worry, I will explain all of these terms as we go through. Radio Access Network has been also evolving and embracing innovations that's happening on IT world. That's why it is important to keep yourself updated about recent developments. I think having basic understanding about distributed run as starting point will assist to grasp other architectural options. That's why I will start defining distributed run with a couple of words. In distributed run model, RRU and BBU are collocated at every cell site. Each cell site with all its radio functions is distributed and connected back to core network through backhaul, which links the access network to core network. Before moving forward, let me explain abbreviations and terms you heard without going into details. BBU is baseband unit. It manages the whole base station, including operating, maintenance, and signal processing. It decides the capacity of the system. On the other hand, RRU is remote radio unit. It interfaces with an antenna on one end and BBU on the other hand. It connects to BBU through common public radio interface and converts radio frequency signals into data signal and vice versa. It does filtering and amplification of RF signal. In fact, it decides the coverage of the system. An antenna, it interfaces a cell phone wirelessly and transmit, receive RF signal. It decides the shape of the coverage. Now we can define CloudRun. In CloudRun, the base one unit moves to centralized location and the cell site only has the antenna and the remote radio unit. This centralization of baseband unit functionality as baseband unit pool makes the architectural transition. NIF interface, which is called front hall, introduced between the RRU and BBU pool. The benefits of CloudRun includes CAPEX and OPEX reduction, as deployment and maintenance costs per cell site are reduced thanks to BBU centralization. In addition, it improves spectral efficiency and reduces inter-channel interferences, as centralized BBUs can share the resources dynamically among the multiple RRUs. The inter-channel interference is reduced because of the joint scheduling and processing. The further split in BBUs as DU and CU was also introduced as second architectural option for CloudRun. The composition of BBU introduced the new interface called MidHull, which is between DU and CU. Now, let's introduce front hall, mid hall, DU, and CU a bit detail. Front hall is the link between RRU and BBU pole, or in other words, RRU and DU. It has string latency requirements. Mid hall is the link between DU and CU. Mid hall has relaxed latency requirements, which means we can place CU further closer to the core node. DU is distributed in it. Distributed unit runs the radio link control, medium access control layers, and parts of physical layer. We normally place DU closer to RRU. CU, as centralized unit, handles the radio resource control and packet data convergence protocol layers, and service data adaptation protocol in case of 5G. One CU can connect to multiple DUs. CU can be collocated with DU or far from DU. After having basic understanding about cloud run, we can start defining virtual run. Virtual run decouples the software from hardware by virtualizing network functions. It uses virtualization technologies such as network function virtualization or containers to deploy CU and DU over commodity servers. So, there is no difference between virtual run and cloud run, except that traditionally cloud run uses proprietary hardware while Virtual run uses network functions on the commodity servers. Because of virtual run hardware software decoupling flexibility, we can achieve scalability. Decoupling brings decrease in hardware costs and application agility, as application can be upgraded easily or swapped altogether easier than bare metal deployments. Now let's take virtual run to next level. While traditionally virtual run is close to network as RRU, DU and CU, which are all part of RUN, must be bought from the same vendor. The Open RUN Alliance is working on specifications to open the interface between RRU 
and du and further between du and cu. This means that a customer can mix and match the components from different vendors without being locked to one vendor for all these three components, thus resulting in an open run network. These new open components as all run and line specs are called open radio unit, open distributed unit, and open centralized unit that are actually a modular base station software stack on off-the-shelf server hardware. So that's it about the difference between cloud run, virtual run, and open run. Hopefully, I could be able to give you an insight on how radio access networks have evolved over the period. Please share your thoughts and comments, and thank you for listening.